Hey everyone, it's Monica with Kids Liz, and today has been a creating day, so I wanted to share with you what I've made. Now, I think I told you that I bought the grommets, and um, Duct Tape Susie, you were saying that yours came with a little tool, so I think that this is probably the same as what you got. So it's this little black piece, and basically you put the longer piece of the grommet through your fabric, which in this case is duct tape, and you put it on that piece, and then you put the smaller piece onto the other side of the, your duct tape fabric in this case, and then you put that on top and you pound the crap out of it with a hammer. <laughs> and it turns out amazing. So let me show you what I have created. So you guys liked the purses that I created, so I ended up making some little over-the-shoulder bags. So it's got a really, really long strap on this one, so it goes over your shoulder like so and Marina fell in love with it right away and it's just a uh, step of velcro I am gonna work on getting some zippers in there I think but I don't know because then I can't really have the box shape that I really really like at the top so I'm loving doing these they're so fun <laughs> so and look there you can see the grommet so now it doesn't pull on the duct tape itself isn't that awesome? Yay! So it's really, really strong. And honestly, I don't see it coming out. So I just used, still using the old trusty hole punch to punch through the duct tape. But I am going to get um, the leather belt hole puncher. So I just have to find out where to get it in Toronto. I'm sure there's some kind of supplier or something that will have it. So when Marina saw this one, she's like, Mommy, I want it done with the baby skulls. So I made her one with the baby skulls. Thank <laughs> you. And I put the pink and white polka dot because on the little bow, can you see it? Pink and white polka dot. So that way it matches. I really, really like this. I'm having so much fun making these, and I am going to do a tutorial, like I said, but I wanted to perfect it first. So I'm, I'm thinking I'm almost there. I don't think I can make too many different things about it um, for it to be good enough to sell, obviously. Um, and then Marina can start making them. That's usually what happens when I come up with a new design for anything. I keep working at it until it's perfect, or at least somewhat perfect. And then, um, and then we start working on them together so that she can create them to sell them. So this one is for her. She doesn't even know it yet. She's in our room with her friend. Her friend is here today, Lauren. I don't know if she's going to record a video with her, but she probably will. So, that's it for today. Thanks for watching, everybody. Love you. Share your smile. Bye.